everyone welcome back to my channel i hope you are all well it's tuesday the 1st of february and thank you for joining me today on my weighing results before i get started i just want to say hello and welcome to all new subby friends that have recently joined my channel my name is stephanie and i'm food optimizing and following slim world at home and yesterday the 31st of january marks my four year anniversary on slim and world so jazz hands and double thumbs up. I feel so much better in myself inside and out. So yay me. So how has my week been? It's not been too bad actually. Food optimizing has been good. Plenty of speed food. You know me, I love my speed food. Plenty of fluids, stayed within my sins. Have I tried anything new? No, not yet. However, I've been watching Alan's channel. His channel is Al Geeky Slimmer. So what I'll do, I'll leave a link to his channel in the description below. He's also following Slimming World. Now, in one of his What I Eat In A Day, he had corn pieces. Now, I saw these, well, I found these in Tesco's. Now, they're on offer with your club card for £1.20. Now, the offer ended yesterday. So when I went shopping yesterday, they already put their prices back up on the corn pieces. So I'll just have to keep a lookout. Plus, the corn pieces are sin free on Slim World. So yeah, so jobs are good. In. So yeah, so once the prices have gone back down again and the club card offers are back in, I'll have a look round and yeah, and I'll let you know what I think of them once I've tried them. Anything else um, with my exercise? I've done what I can. As you know, yesterday I mentioned about my Fitbit Charge 3 is no longer working. So Ian was kind enough, <laughs> treated me to a new Fitbit Charge 4. So far it's working brilliantly. Um, the big test is when I go out for a walk. So I'll let you know how that goes. Um, anything else? Yes, myself and Ian, we went to the cinema last week and we went to watch Belfast. It's a very good film. I highly recommend it. Very heartwarming. It's based on a true story. And I think with true story, films that are based on true stories um, are much better. But that's my, that's my opinion. So yeah, so if you haven't seen it, I recommend you watch it. If you have seen it, let me know in the comments below what you think of it. So yeah, so jobs are good. And I rate it a five star. So yeah, so all good. Um, I had a blood test last week, um, I rang up the doctor yesterday and I was told to ring back today, so I did, and the blood test has confirmed that I am going through menopause, yay! So now I know why I'm getting hot flushes and um, feeling cold, so yeah, so it's like Katy Perry, isn't it? You're hot and you're cold, da, 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 da. you've got that song in your head now, haven't you? <laughs> okay then. So yeah, so, but I mean, I know you've got, you know, you can have meds for it and you've got patches for your menopause, but I'm going to just see how I go. And then um, the doctor said, if I need support and help, then I can just ring up and get an appointment and see what they can do for me. But I'm going to see how I go first. Just take each day as it comes. So yeah, so all good. Um, my mum was 45, 46 when she started her menopause and I'm 46. So, but yeah, it is what it is, isn't it? It is what it is. Hey ho, <sighs> being part of a woman, isn't it really? Yeah. Anyhow, um, anything else happening? Oh, yeah, can't forget this. Woo! We had two birthdays at the end of the month. On Saturday, the 29th of January, our youngest son, Andrew, he turned 23. And yesterday, the 31st of January, our eldest son, Ian, he turned 25. Ah. <gasps> I know they grow up so quickly, don't they? But we are extremely proud of both of them because they have turned into such brilliant gentlemen as they really have. Yeah, they've done us proud. So nice one, lads. Nice one. Anyway, I'm going to go to my diary. I'll let you know how I got on. And yeah, we'll go from there. So. Last Tuesday, which was... 25th of January I ended on my full 15 sins like I always do 26th of January Wednesday 9 sins Thursday the 27th of January 11 and a half sins 
Friday the 28th of January, 11 sins. Saturday the 29th of January, 6 sins. Sunday the 30th of January, 8 and a half sins. And yesterday, all together now, Sin Free Monday. Yes, Sin Free Monday. So, last Tuesday, the 25th of January, I stepped on the scales and I had a loss of one pound. And it left me on nine stone, ten pound. I stepped on the scales today and I had a loss of Oops, <laughs> one pound. I've really got to learn to write properly, haven't I? Straight anyway. So this is week 210. I now weigh nine stone, nine pound, and altogether I've lost seven stone. So yeah, so I'm pleased with that. Yep, I'm just going to carry on what I'm doing, do the best I can and keep moving forward. Plans for this week. Um, Thursday, myself, Ian, my best friend Andrea and her hubby Matthew We're all going out for a meal on Thursday So the table's all booked for that And yes, it's going to be a chillax day Because I'm going to have pudding So, you know, me and my best are saying it's the rules, you know I've got to have pudding But I'll be back to food optimising on Friday so Yeah, so jobs are good and So, if I do have a gain, I know where it's come from but as long as I'm still within my target, I'm okay. Now, if you are new to my channel, my target is 10 stone. And if I would, if I would be going to group, I'd be out of my target range because you're allowed three pound above, three pounds below. And now I'm nine stone nine, I would be out of it. But because I do swim well at home, I'm not too worried about it. So if I do lose extra pounds, I'm fine with that. So yeah, so, but I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm happy. Nine stone nine, seven stone loss. Jobs are good in. And like I said, if I do have a gain next week after the meal, I know where it's coming from. But I know full well I'll be back on food optimising on Friday anyway. So yeah, so all good. Anyway, let me know how you've gotten yourselves this week. Whatever journey you are following, whatever works best for you. If it's working, that's brilliant. But just remember, February is a brand new month, fresh start. If you want to change it up a little, go for it. If not, just do your best. That's all we have to do in it really is do our best. Anyway, I'm going to love you and leave you. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, subscribe. It's free to do so. Hit that notification bell for more upcoming videos. And as always, keep smiling, stay positive and take care. And I'll see you soon. Bye for now.